Marshall. Marshall Falk is a native of New Orleans, and as a kid, hawked popcorn and soda at Saints games at the Superdome, and later returned to that turf as one of the game's greatest running backs. He was an All-American at San Diego State, the only school that recruited him as a running back. In one game as a freshman, he rushed for 386 yards and seven touchdowns. Indianapolis selected Falk as the second player taken in the 94 draft. After five productive seasons with the Colts, Falk was traded to the Rams in a contract dispute for two draft choices. The trade helped transform the Rams into a juggernaut offense, maybe the best trade in NFL history, at least from the Rams' point of view. With his amazing speed, ability, and intelligence, Falk was a key component of the greatest show on turf, helping the Rams to two Super Bowls. His first season with the Rams was one for the ages. He rushed for 1,381 yards and caught 87 passes for almost 1,100 more. His total of 2,429 yards from scrimmage was an NFL record. Falk was the NFL's Offensive Player of the Year. I don't show a lot of emotion, and I go out there and I play, and I play hard. And, and that's just basically it. I don't say much. There's not much to say. You know, you go out there and you let your performance speak, and that's how I like to do it. I feel like there's nothing that I can't do on the football field. Although I understand that, you know, I can't do it all, I, I like to believe that I can. Marshall Falk's career numbers are staggering. He was the NFL's MVP of the 2000 season and the league's Offensive Player of the Year in 1999, 2000, and 2001. He's the only player to reach 10,000 yards rushing and 5,000 yards receiving. His five games of 250 yards from scrimmage and 14 games of 200 plus yards from scrimmage are also NFL records. He's the only player to have more than 70 rushing touchdowns and more than 30 receiving touchdowns. He's the only running back in history to lead his team in receptions in five separate seasons. But injuries did what opponents could not do, slow and eventually stop one of the greatest running backs in the game. A broken hand and knee injuries began to eat at his playing time. Finally, reconstructive knee surgery ended his career in 2006. Falk moved from the field of the broadcast booth. Rams fans will never forget his brilliant performances and we welcome one of the best the game has ever seen. Number 28, Marshall Falk, into the St. Louis Sports Hall of Fame.